And joining me now uh, is Shraddha Bindru, Makhanlal Bindru's daughter. Remember, Shraddha's uh, emotive statements have caught everyone's attention. Shraddha, thanks very much for joining you. We saw you giving out a very brave message, tough message to those who've killed your father. First of all, all our deep condolences to you and the family. You've really come out so strongly in that video. How are you personally dealing with this tragedy, though? See, I'll just say one thing. I'm dealing with this tragedy because I'm carrying forward the teachings given by my father. The best teaching which I've seen in him, that is being fearless. He was fearless. He was not a coward. The person who killed him, he was a coward because he shot him from the back. Had he been a strong man, he would have come in front, talked to him if he had any issues or any problems. So what I've learned from my father is fearlessness. And that fearlessness is allowing, helping all of us to walk forward in life. You know, I couldn't agree with you. Me, uh, more terrorists are cowards. There's no, they absolutely are. Your father and his family, uh, Shraddha, were among the few Kashmiri pundits who stayed back in the valley, even when the community was driven out in the early 90s so his fearlessness was seen in just what he did i mean he was clearly a very brave man committed to the people of the kashmir valley yes he was a very brave man he was among a very few hindus who didn't leave kashmir you know i was the only hindu person who was studying in my class there were no other hindu girls in my class they were very I don't remember also. I think I was the only Hindu girl. But my father used to tell me, why are you fearless? Why are you fearful of anything? Go and just win the world by being fearless. You know, the death of your father has triggered a wave of anger among Kashmiri Muslims and Kashmiri Pandits. People recognize the work your father was doing. They obviously, he struck a chord. Do you think though it will make a difference to this cycle of violence that the Kashmir Valley is gripped with, Shraddha? See, if I, this is a very good question, very, very good question, that my father's death has actually raised a wave of anger. But I believe, personally, if you ask me, being a Hindu, I have read the Bhagavad Gita, I have read the Quran, I have even read the Bible. And all the religions say that hatred, anger, they lead to nowhere. Only love, patience, kindness, they will take you forward. So I really don't want to spread any message of anger, here, hatred. I would just like to tell to all the people, all the people of Kashmir, spread love. In Sanyat to Raklo, just have some humanity and, think, and I think all the roads will open up for you. What, what is your message though, uh, Shraddha, to the government? As someone today who still, I'm sure, is grieving deep inside, what's your message to the government? See, my message to the government is to all the government pol political leaders, everyone is, please, please, please don't work for, for your own interest. Work for the interest of the people. Agar aap ye yaad rakhenge that you have to go back to God and you have to be answerable to God, do good deeds in the world. Be a human being. Thodi insaniyat rakh lijiye. Allah ke raste pe chaliye. Hum sab Allah ki baat karte hain. Allah ke raste pe chaliye. Neki ke raste pe chaliye. I think that's the message I would like to give to the government officials and the government political leaders. I couldn't agree more again with you. Insaniyat, you know, is really the touchstone in a way of how to take Kashmir forward. Everyone condoled Shraddha, the demise of your father, because he'd served the community, served Kashmiris, Kashmiri Muslims, Pandits, everyone around him. How do you see, who, do you see people taking that legacy of Insaniyat forward in the valley? I'll tell you one thing, Makhanlal Bindru is only one. There can't be another Makhanlal Bindru. Makhanlal Bindru is only one. There can't be another Makhanlal Bindru. And out of all our family members to become Makhanlal Bindru, oh my God, he was a legacy and he was such a strong man. I think, I don't know who can, who can match his level. So I think I would really not comment. He was an incredible human being. He was the best father. He was the best pharmacist in, the Kashmir, in Kashmir Valley, right? 
you have a message in the end to give shraddha to those who have killed your father my message to those who have killed him is ki aapne to ye soch ke unhe mara ki aap allah ke raste pe chal rahe ho ki aap insaan ki aap jannat ka rasta paoge but क्या आपका अल्लाह आपको ये सिखाता है कि जो कश्मीर में सेवा कर रहा है कश्मीर में लोगों की मदद कर रहा है उसको जाकर गोली मारो और आपके लिए जन्नत का रास्ता खोलेगा वो तो आपने अपने लिए जहनम का रास्ता खोल दिया है सर जिसने भी उसे उन्हें गोली मारी है अपने अल्लाह से ही पूछना एक दिन अकेले बैठना आई विश आप ये इंटरव्यू देख रहे होंगे जिस दिन उन्होंने मेरे फादर को गोली मारी है अकेले बैठना ठीक है और अपने अल्लाह तला से ही पूछना जिसने कश्मीरियों को सर्व किया है क्या वो इंसान ये डिजर्व करता था जस्ट एक मोटिव के लिए क्योंकि आपको एक न्यूज बनानी थी तो आपने बिंदरू को मार दिया श्रद्धा यू स्पोकन विद योर हार्ट एंड आई थिंक यू टचड अ कॉर्ड विद मिलियंस ऑफ पीपल टुडे वंस अगेन माय कंडोलेंसेस टू यू एंड योर फैमिली आर प्रेयर्स ओम शांति टू यू एंड देम थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर जॉइनिंग मी हियर टुडे थैंक यू